Welcome to the Disney Reporter. I am your Disney Reporter, Mr. Daps. Let's get right to this week's Disney and Geek Headlines. We start things off this week at Disneyland, where there's a lot of new experiences coming in the coming week. First off, at Star Wars Galaxy's Edge, Star Wars Rise of the Resistance will be arriving on Friday, January 17th. Daps Magic will be covering this opening day, so make sure to follow all of our social media, YouTube, and this website as well, so that you don't miss any of our coverage. And ahead of the game, we have a guide for those who are intending to go on Star Wars Rise of the Resistance that is up on the website. Stop by, check it out, and let us know if you have any tips to add to the tips that we have for experiencing Star Wars Rise of the Resistance. That is this Friday, January 17th, and you won't want to miss it. Over at Disney California Adventure, also this Friday, is the Lunar New Year celebration that's returning for another year. We've got details about the food that you can experience for the Lunar New Year celebration, along with the entertainment and other experiences that will be available up on the website. Stop by, check it out, and let us know what you think your favorite part of the Lunar New Year celebration is that runs from January 17th through February 24th. This week at Disney California Adventure, Anaheim Ducks Day was celebrated. We've got details and video up about all of that. Make sure to stop by the website and check it out. Even if you're not a Ducks fan, it's still kind of fun. For those of you looking forward to visiting Disneyland this spring, there's been some discounts that were announced this week that can save you substantial money and make it as cheap as $67 a day if you're a SoCal resident. Or if you're a child, you can also get that deal. We've got the specifics up on the website. Stop by, check it out, and let us know if you're going to utilize this way to get into the Disneyland Resort. And we wrap up the Disneyland portion of our coverage with a look at what's coming in 2020. We've got details about everything that will be arriving at the Disneyland Resort that we know of so far, along with every other Disney theme park. We've got this entire guide up on the website. Stop by, check it out, and let us know what you're most excited for in 2020 in Disney theme parks. Hopping on over to Disney news, we've also got a similar guide of everything that's coming from the Walt Disney Company in 2020 as well. This includes Pixar, Disney Animation, this also includes Marvel, there's no Star Wars, but also some Fox properties. Check them out and let us know what you're most excited for in 2020 from Disney movies. In other big Disney movie news this week, Frozen 2 became the most successful animated film of all time. We've got the details about just how much it has made so far and how much it continues to make on the website. Stop by, check it out, and let us know, do you think that this title is worthy of this crown? And finally, Star Wars The Clone Wars will be arriving on Disney Plus in just about a month, and we've got the specific date, February 17th, for when it will be arriving on Disney Plus. We've got the details up on the website. Stop by, check it out, and let us know what you think about this return of this animated Star Wars series. And those are the top Disney and geek headlines we have for you this week. We hope you are having a very happy new year. We hope you'll take a moment to let us know in the comments below what you think the top story of the week was or is. We also hope you'll take a moment to subscribe to this YouTube channel and dapsmagic.com so you don't miss any of the daily Disney and geek news. And we also hope you have a fantastic weekend and week ahead. We look forward to seeing you in the parks.